and this is Pro Wrestling Unlimited. So as we reported, I guess you could say really, really early this morning, Rich Swan has been arrested for domestic battery and false imprisonment. The police department in Gainesville, Florida has released the actual police report and we do now know what led to the incident and Swan's arrest. The incident took place in Gainesville, Florida roughly around 11.30 p.m. last night. Swan was with his wife, professional wrestler Sue Young. The two were engaged in an argument as they were heading back from a show Young had been working. Swan was critiquing the match and began to get angry. Young got scared the argument was going to escalate and got out of the car. Swan stopped the car in the middle of traffic to get out. Swan chased after Young and yelled at her to get back in the car. Young told Swan she did not want to and continued to walk away. Swan then grabbed Young by both her neck and arms, placing her in a headlock and dragging her back to the car. Young screaming for help was then shoved into the car by Swan. A witness who saw the incident called police. Witness number one said Swan chased after Young and did in fact put her in a headlock, forcing her back into the vehicle. Witness number one said Young was screaming and beating on the car window from the inside that she needed help as Swan drove off. Witness number one also said that Young seemed very scared and just wanted to get away. A second witness said that they saw the car being driven by Swan and it was being driven erratically. Witness number two said when Swan jumped out of the vehicle, he did not place the car in park as it was still in motion. As the car was still in motion, it did veer forward and hit a telephone pole. Young stated to police she was afraid because Swan has a temper sometimes. She said that she was trying to get away. She said that she was trying to get away from him because she was afraid the argument would escalate into something physically violent. Young said that she told Swan to pull over the car so she can exit the vehicle, and when he refused to, she jumped out while the car was still in motion. After having his rights read to him, Swan stated that he did not grab Young or place her back in the vehicle. Swan stated she got back in the car on her own and he never physically touched her. Swan stated that he was trying to get her to get back in the vehicle because the phone that they were using for GPS was actually her phone and they were just trying to get home. Finally, the report does state that the two have been in a relationship for approximately five years and married about nine months ago. So I assume he ain't working Monday Night Raw tomorrow night. He's supposed to have a big number one contenders match against Drew Gulak. And if we do hear anything else on Rich Swan, him being arrested, this whole incident, and what this means for his WWE career, we'll have it for you right here on Pro Wrestling Unlimited. But that's going to do it for this episode. Remember to comment below, like, and share this video. Like us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Subscribe here on YouTube and follow PWUnlimited.net for the latest in pro wrestling news.